Ben from WP Speed Fix here, and I thought I would make a very short video because we've had a few clients asking about it this week for recapture alternatives or capture alternatives. We don't like captures, they are slow, they are heavy, they add one or two seconds at least to your page load speed, which is not good. Some plugins like Contact Form 7 even add the recapture site wide regardless of whether there is a contact form on the page. So basically you've slowed down all the pages by one or two seconds, basically not good. So from a speed optimization perspective, we don't want to use captures or recaptures. That's great for speed, not so good for spam. So let me explain a simple Cloudflare firewall rule that we add to filter traffic um, and stop spam. So basically I've just got a Cloudflare account open here. And in the free Cloudflare account, you can add five firewall rules. This is a paid one, so we have 20. But if you go here under security and WAF web application firewall, you can add a new rule. So you can create firewall rule. And I'm gonna show you this rule here. And in the post linked from this video, I will give you the code so you can just copy and paste the code in. Um, but if I hit here, it hit this um, tool icon here, this is the rule that I have. So what we're basically doing is capturing all the traffic or sending all the visitors outside Australia. So this is an Australian site. So um, it's not targeting visitors outside Australia. So what we're doing, anyone who's outside Australia that visits the site, they get basically like an automated Cloudflare capture rule. You've probably seen it from time to time when you go to a website and it comes up with a security warning, it's checking to make sure you're a real user. That's probably Cloudflare and that's what this rule does. So in this case, we have people who are outside Australia, so they're not in Australia, and they're not a known bot. So we don't want to, we want to be careful with these rules. We don't want to block Google, that's a problem. If we block Google and Bing and other important search crawlers, then we're gonna screw up our SEO and not rank in the search results. So these two here are what you want by default, and I'll include the string that, that creates this rule. Um, you want to edit this so it's your own country or the country country or countries you're targeting. Um, I think you can also do continent. You can do continent as well. So if you're in Europe, um, you can you can use that um, or North America, I think as well. Um, so that will give you kind of broader coverage. The rules still work, but it'll cover more countries and it's a bit more broad. But you want these two guys at a minimum. This rule has some extra bits and pieces in it because we're using some tools on this website. So this is an SEO, this is a website that our SEO agency is doing work on. So these are some of the tools we use. Optio, TrueClicks, SiteLiner, Screaming Frog, and Surfer SEO. So what this does, this stops blocking those bots or user agents as well. They're not in the known known bots list at Cloudflare. I think Cloudflare only has like 15 known bots. I'll link you up to their post that lists them all. Google and Bing are definitely those. Ahrefs I think is another, and there's, there's several others. But anyway, we added these guys in as extra rules, so we're not blocking them either because adding this rule will break automated tools that are hitting your website, so you might wanna add those in. But that's it pretty much. Um, that's how to do it. So that's how to filter traffic outside your home country. It won't really hurt real users if you have you know, 3% of your traffic still outside your home country. All it does is send them through uh, a, like Cloudflare security, automated security um, check. That's what JS Challenge is. You want to avoid, um, there's also Manage Challenge is another option. You don't really want to use that or the legacy capture like that. You want to avoid using those because then you're going to have to, your users are going to have to do the select the boats or select the airplanes or whatever it is, the really annoying capture that, you know, it takes you, you know, five goes to get because the image is so blurry or doesn't, doesn't look clear at all. Um, so you want to use JS Challenge. That's the automated capture. But anyway, that's it, nice short video, very simple. Um, I'll, as I said, I'll link you up to the post where you can just copy and paste this expression here. So I'll just show you here what, actually before we finish, I'll show you here. So I'll just copy that and I'll just go back if you wanna create your own rule. So just click create firewall rule and then you can click edit expression and just copy in the um, text I give you, save it as draft, oops. I'll just give it a name, test rule. Um, if you save it as draft, oops, um, it's erroring out because it's duplicate. Let me just change that to say UK. Save as draft. 
and you'll see there it has added the rule. We go back and edit it um, just by copying and pasting. So we just select our country. So we just say, you know, UK or whatever it is there. Anyway, that's it. Hope you found that useful. Let me know if you have any questions. Post in the comments. If you want to uh, some help with your site speed, head over to wpspeedfix.com um, where you can request a free site speed audit where we'll have a look at your site and tell you how we can help. There's also a free speed test tool there that will give you detailed speed optimization insights and recommendations in about 90 seconds. Totally for free, no opt-ins, any of that jazz. Anyway, leave it to it. Cheers.